Good morning, guys. So today is Friday, March 10th. Yeah. March 10th. Um, counting down the days to Rick's birthday because that's our cheat day. Woohoo! So, anyways, so hopefully you guys watched the video. I think he has to leave. Oh, never mind. Hopefully you guys watched the video on Stop It With The Bullshit Workouts. So apparently a lot of people... Three? Don't like it. Three. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think some people got it fucked up and don't didn't really pay attention to it. Instead just started judging. I'm not, I'm not saying, especially one person, she was like, Oh, maybe we should judge you for not having lost weight in three years. Bitch! Back the fuck up. Because, one, it's all about diet. It's not because my workouts suck. My workouts are legit. My workouts have sculpted my body, as you have seen my before and after pictures. Yeah, and when the diet's been on point, you've been dropping like a motherfucker. Yeah, and because my diet has been 100%. My workouts have been 100%. My cardio has been 100%. You guys seen every single week. That is why I've been doing this weigh-in. Because, you know, if I decided to share my journey with you guys, I decided to share the truth, the realness, you know? the. It took me, it's been my whole life I've been overweight. So it's, obviously, it's not going to take me a freaking year like these shows that people are so obsessed with uh, people are so obsessed with quickness with these lose a hundred pounds in three months uh, shows you know or 90 how, how many weeks uh, like on the biggest loser I uh, mean they lose it but then you see them yeah, now and they're, but they're then you see them twice as big as they were later on and they gained their weight why because because it's about a mental progress and physical progress will follow you know um, it's it's hard when you've been overweight for so long you can't just drop it all and you feel people are not supportive because you're not dropping it so fast that they're like me they don't give a fuck you know they don't they don't know the fucking struggle it is a damn struggle and it's an everyday choice to not continue to be where you were before um but anyways so all i said was there's no need to do lunges on a treadmill. That if you are overweight, if you are not fit, it's not gonna do nothing for you. Just stand somewhere, lunge. I don't care if you're a person doing actual cardio. I wasn't speaking about someone who's actually using the machine for cardio and going slow. I'm not, t I'm, I don't, I'm not judging that. You know, at least you're doing something. I go fucking slow on the treadmill. I don't give a fuck. Um, all I'm saying is, don't freaking do lunges and those bullshit IG uh, videos that you see. Those those are not gonna get you the way the, these girls look. Um, so I think people misconstrued my words because I got some messages and. It's like, you make no fucking sense. You're just turning my words around. I didn't say people going slow on the treadmill. You're doing cardio. You're doing it right. I'm talking about lunging and these bullshit workouts on the machines. And bullshit, bullshitting people about home workouts. That you, even the P, people doing the P90X or whatever the hell they're called. You're not going to look the same as those girls. Because those girls or men are super muscular why you're not gonna get that off of body workouts okay yeah they're just paid they, to be on the freaking just commercials paid to be on there so that's what I'm trying to get at don't fall for this stupid ass shit you're not gonna look just like that so don't expect those exact results for yourself while working out at home you are gonna lose weight but that is all you're gonna get you're not gonna get defined but quads pop in muscular muscularity you're not gonna get that if you're not doing weights. Um, we're just rambling on again. And we gotta get our arm workout because I gotta go to work today. Yeah, me too.
guys so I just got off of work I'm home now this is my room um so today I did arms and then I went to work I was on my feet all day um running around so no cardio for today but tomorrow and Sunday I'll do cardio so for now it is good night See you guys tomorrow morning. Peace out. And yes, my face is extra shiny because it was hot and I decided to wear makeup. Because I'm wearing like this ugly ass yellow and I have to wear a hat. So I didn't want to look like a boy. So tried to beauti beautify it up a little bit. So see you guys tomorrow morning. Good night. Hey guys, today is Saturday, March 11th. It is almost 9 o'clock at night. Um, I went to work this morning at 10 in the morning. But I got dropped off early. So, um, I decided I needed two days off of cardio. Um, so, like I told you guys, sometimes I do five days a week of weights not sometimes i always do five days a week of weights five days of cardio sometimes seven well not today we, tomorrow i will do cardio not today i i've been out in the heat anybody that's been to california adventure and has seen where i work i work in the outdoors i work outside and the freaking sun was insane today. Not just that. It was super freaking busy. Well, you already did four days of cardio, so tomorrow will be five. So yeah, that's still a lot. Yeah, but still. I'm exhausted. And not just that. I was like running around at work because um, I was running drinks and things like that. And getting stuff that we need. So I had to go back and forth, back and forth. So... My feet are freaking killing me, and I'm tired. I need sleep. Some people are asking where you work at Disneyland California Adventure. So where can these people find you? Don't look for me. <laughs> I get shy, and then there's a lot of new people who don't know that I'm on Instagram, and um, or so, YouTube. So I get shy. And then the people that are at the bar are like, what is she doing? Like, why are they looking for you? Like, it's just weird. And then they start asking questions. And then it just gets really weird. So, yeah, you can find her at the bar area of California Adventure. <laughs> or Food and Wine. That just is, look for, that this, is just look for a Big Bird in the yellow yeah. outfit. <laughs> looking bird. like mustard. <laughs> <laughs> That's the opposite guy you guys did. Uh, yeah. So, I'm... Doing um, the bars at California Adventure. And if you, not the Cove Bar. Not not those bars. But anyways, Hollywoodland. You can find me somewhere in Hollywoodland. But don't ask for me. So, because <laughs> <laughs> I get I get shy, and then I don't know what to say, and then I'm just weird, and then especially when I'm at work because. Uh, if you come up to, like, my bar, this is what I'm going to say. What can I get you? Or what do you want? If if I have an attitude that day, I'll say. And you're just standing there, I'm going to be like, what do you want? Because, you know, sometimes the sun is there. It's just hot. And it's so busy. You get a little attitude sometimes because the guest gives you attitude. So you pop one to unnecessary people. So that's what I do. Don't judge me. But anyways. So yeah. So tomorrow um, I work early again. So I will be doing my cardio extra early. So therefore I'm going to go to bed now. So that I can wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning. To be able to do that. Get my stuff together. And then I have to go to work. Be, f be at work by 9. So yeah. I miss my days off already. Good night, guys. 
so no one is even here. It's 5.30 in the morning. Good morning guys. Today is Sunday, March 12th and it's spring forward. Fuck you spring forward. Um, it is 5.40 in the morning, so technically 4.40 in the morning. All I know is it takes me a couple of alarms to wake up. So, so yeah, been waking up since 4.50 and then eventually got up after three or four alarms. But who's counting? Um, time for us to do our cardio, head home, eat, then go to work. I know it's funny as people say, you need to do cardio? And they assume you don't do cardio? That's because they don't watch my shit. Watch my shit, watch my videos, read the fucking description on the pictures, and then say, do you do cardio? Or only weights? Well, stop being lazy, like I said before, and do your research but yeah so one hour cardio this morning and then um work and then yeah so i don't know what was i thinking about oh yeah people say i curse too much if you don't like it to go away because uh well I've been cussing since I was a baby. I'm the seventh child. The age gap is uh 17 years and then from the oldest to me then my sister who's the sixth child is a six year gap from her to me. So yeah, basically, they made me cuss and stuff. So, uh, when I was little, I had a really bad mouth, and that's what everybody knows me for, having a bad mouth, and saying exactly what I felt. So, if you think that you commenting you should do this, you should do that, you shouldn't cuss so much. Nobody fucking cares, nobody fucking asks you. So, I'm here giving tons of free information and showing you realness and showing you what to do. Instead, people wanna make excuses and um, try and be like, oh no, you can't get blah 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 from home workouts if you add a vest. Fuck you and your fucking vest. Nobody's gonna fucking go out of their way, buy a vest to do a home fucking workout. Like, let's keep it real. That's not gonna fucking happen. So, don't come on my shit inputting your unwanted information, okay? Because I'm just going to look at it and I'm going to be like, this motherfucker is stupid as fuck. I ain't going to respond. So, that's what's going to happen when you put your unwanted two cents in, okay? I mean, it's one thing if they're writing like some... If some stuff that's actually 
actually useful and something knowledgeable that I didn't know, then I will listen. But if you come at me with some bullshit on how I shouldn't lift or how, um, how I shouldn't say that home workouts aren't gonna get you results, I didn't say they're not gonna get you results. I said they're not gonna make you look muscular, sculpted, like everybody wanna look like Tiana Taylor. You're not gonna look like that from just doing cardio. And whoever said that your muscles will tone as you lose weight? Without lifting. Without lifting? You full of shit. Because if these people that lost tons of weight yet yeah, end up with nothing but skin, think about it. There was no sculpting of muscles under there. If anything, your muscle fucking eats away even more. So, you need a combination of all three. Weights, cardio, clean eating, and, oh yeah, and then some mofo had the nerve to go on my shit and talk about, oh, well, you wouldn't like it if people judged you for not having any results in three years. First of all, who the fuck said I was trying to get results in the beginning? I was just trying to lift because it made me happy. And I never said, oh, blah, 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 blah. And then when I was trying to lose weight, I did lose weight. I know. If you, if and I did my Spartan race. And I did a Tough mother. Something you probably ain't never fucking done other than sit behind your fucking computer doing fucking snack reviews. Get the fuck out of here. People piss me off. And guess what? If you didn't get results, how come you're almost about to hit 40 pounds in less than 90 days? Yeah. Now, when you're now, I care, now I care about all three things. Now I care about losing weight. And... My workouts have always been on point. So, with that being said. All right, let's let you get back to it so you can yes. speed up. Because people gonna make my blood pressure go high as fuck, because I get really fucking irritated. <laughs> but for you guys who just watch to support, who comment sweet things, thank you, booze. Okay guys, cardio is done, light is out, and we out here getting our shit done. So, make sure to get yours, and now it's time for me to go to work, gotta go shower, get my shit together, and go work like the rest of y'all. So, let's go. So, it is Monday, March... 13. Guess whose birthday's tomorrow? Rick's. Um, so yeah. So today is Monday. I worked last night. Um, I worked like nine and a half hours, I'm gonna say. And I was the transporter again, which means I run back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, bringing alcohol. Or whatever they need and guess what happened to me take a while guess keep on guessing nope 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 and nope so a freaking um, half keg fell on my fucking foot and um, it's a little sore it's a little swollen it's a little bruised um, but it's, I can still move my toes like this. So, so far, so good guys. Just tender and a little, little painful putting on my shoes. But um, yeah, so thank goodness my foot is not broken because if it had been, 
you know, the, I've been looking for that voodoo doll because somebody trying to sabotage my shit. So, with that being said, it's time to go work on these turkey legs of mine. So, see you guys at the gym. Let's go. <laughs> just got done with the shittiest workout I've had in a very long time um, no excuses like I say but today was shitty as fuck um, did two sets of 25s two sets of 45s three sets on um, the leg press out and in since I didn't do uh, straight legs I made sure I did the close um stance so that it can target the the back of my, my hamstrings the back of my legs and i'm just not feeling it today yesterday like i told you guys i dropped a small keg on my foot and it was hurting coming up it wasn't hurting when i was coming down so like the pushing like pushing towards the floor like making sure that my feet stay t really tight to the floor like I'm pushing through the floor um, was a struggle it, it definitely hurt um, I know it's not broken but for sure it's it's hurt um, I can walk and whatnot but it's it just feels really tight and painful and bruised like somebody just punched you you know yeah it's feeling. all it's all red yeah that feeling that you get so um anyways i know we, also, haven't, we haven't had a day off in like yeah that's what i was gonna say 10 weeks or something so it's been like two and a half months since i've taken a complete complete rest day where i just just don't do shit i've been doing an hour to two hours of cardio even on my days off of work Yesterday, I did the hour of cardio, went to work, and worked almost nine and a half hours, ten hours. So, and I was a runner, which means walking like two blocks and then two blocks back. So, just to deliver stuff, and not just that, lifting kegs, lifting this, lifting that, because I had to transfer all the stuff. So, um yes i'm tired i really need a day off like bad so tomorrow's rick's birthday we are going to finally wait, have a cheat day finally have a cheat day i've for sure like really freaking depleted already like ugh, i'm tired I haven't had much sleep, pain, I'm in pain on my foot, everything else is okay, you know, other than that, um, but yeah, I for sure need a rest day, so. That'll be Wednesday. That'll be Wednesday. I'm taking a rest day, guys. I need it. I deserve it. I've been work busting my ass, not just in the gym, but I've been working, and it's, 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 it's about time I have a rest day. So. 
See you guys later. Time for me to Guess they get to see my long toe. So you see? All swollen. Bruised. Don't judge me and I get my toes done today. Tomorrow. Today. Hi guys, so today is Monday. It's still Monday. Still Monday. March thirteenth. Thirteenth. Oh yeah, I can't forget that. Um so, earlier was leg day, then I went to work, and then, that was it, just been working all day. Um, then you went shopping and bought sandals and got your toes done. Then I done. went shopping, got my toes done, blah, 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 blah. So, tomorrow is Rick's birthday. He's an old man. And, um, so tomorrow is going to be Disney Day. With obviously Rick for his birthday, my nieces and my sister and my sister in law. So it's gonna be a family day, followed by cheat day. Cheat day. <laughs> I don't know, we haven't had a cheat meal. We haven't had a cheat meal since in... before like New Year's. Yeah, so like two, two and a half months. Two. Yeah, I guess you can say two and a half months. Um, so yeah, so today I weighed in at 290... Shit, I forgot. 292.2. 292.2. Put it right over the screen. You'll put it in the screen. I always forget, um, especially because come nighttime, I'm sleepy. And I know I'm going to gain weight, obviously. But this is planned. But this is a planned cheat meal. I told you guys since the beginning that we have a planned cheat meal um happening in march and march crap creeped up on us so yeah tomorrow's rick's birthday then after that we'll be right back to it can't wait to eat some steak right snacks right back to it after that right back to it on wednesday and we're gonna make a video on why you shouldn't have a cheat meal meal or day every or day, week every week weekend that's coming soon so yeah that's coming soon, and you'll see why. And yeah, can't wait to take you guys on our trip tomorrow. So, time for me to go to sleep. I'm exhausted. And see you guys tomorrow morning. Tomorrow is chest day, then Disneyland, and fun time. So, see you guys later. <laughs> what about like, comment, subscribe? Like, comment, subscribe.